Hi folks, my name's Gordy Lambert and I'm with General RV Center, the nation's largest family-owned RV dealership. With 11 stores and over 2,500 RVs to choose from. Today we'll be looking at the new 2015 Momentum 385TH toy hauler. Let's go take a look. Okay folks, we're going to start out with the front cap on this beautiful fifth wheel. It's fully painted and has a nice LED light in front so that you could see at night when you're hooking up. Also it has a, a Trail Air Rotoflex pin box that is designed to help prevent the chucking that you get when you're pulling a fifth wheel. Uh, you'll also notice there's a 5500 watt Onan generator that comes with this unit and that's more than enough to power everything including the two airs that come standard on this one. Uh, the walls are two and a quarter inch thick which provide R11 insulation compared to a two inch wall that has R9 insulation. As we come down to the uh, storage compartment here you'll notice how large and deep it is and there's no hump to go over that's because the uh, the I-beam is a drop rail which allows for flat storage. There's even a place for a TV to hook up. You can grab the TV out of the bedroom and put it here and watch a ball game at night underneath the awning. When you come to the doorway, it's a 30 inch wide door as opposed to 28 inches. And the stairs are aluminum and very easy to operate. They won't rust either like steel ones do. Also there's a nice grab handle here. The awnings, if you notice, there's two of them and they cover 28 feet of the side of this fifth wheel. The windows are a frameless, very heavily tinted. Also you have a triple step on the secondary entry door which is also 30 inches. The ladder pulls away to make it easier to go up and down and then stows away for travel. That's a really nice feature. Also, you have a fuel pump with its own 30-gallon fuel tank. And next to that, you have another 30-gallon fuel tank just for the generator. The suspension is an Equiflex suspension that helps reduce up to 60% of the road noise due to vibration. As we come along this way, your docking station is very well done. You have a water filter for the whole unit and you've got your cable hookups and everything else inside there. And as we come to this side, you've got your controls for your auto leveling. We'll start our inside demonstration in the bedroom. It has a nice walk-in closet with room on both sides for a separate washer and dryer. If you notice too, it has a king-size bed and underneath you have plenty of room for extra storage and a lockbox for your valuables. Also, you have a pull-out stool. On this side of the bed, you have a four-drawer, extra-large chest of drawers and a 32-inch color TV. Also, the air conditioner in the bedroom is ducted throughout instead of just hanging down like a lot of fifth wheels. Okay, as we leave the master bedroom, we notice that the door leading into the bedroom is a solid door and it has a header off over the top of it, which is much nicer than just a gap, which a lot of fifth wheels have. In the bathroom, you have a porcelain foot flush toilet, a vessel sink, and a large 48 inch shower. You also have a linen closet for all your linens, which is not very common in most of your fifth wheels. Okay, folks, as we come down to the living area, I'd like to point out the control center, which has switches to virtually everything on the unit your uh, uh, generator, your hot water tank, your slide rooms, your awning, and whatnot. As you come down to the living area, you have a beautiful designer four-seat sofa with footrests that come out of each section. So four people could be sitting here with their feet up watching a beautiful 50-inch LED TV that swivels to make it easier for viewing. Also underneath that, you have a beautiful fireplace that produces heat, and also an AM, FM, CD, DVD player. As we come to the kitchen, you have a beautiful four-door, 12-cubic-foot Norcold refrigerator. Your countertops are solid surface. You have a really nice modern 
faucet with a pull-out sprayer. That's good for getting the larger pans. Your stove oven uh, is a three burner stove with a 22 inch deep oven, which will accommodate virtually anything that you need to bake. The microwave is a 30 inch microwave, one of the largest on the market. Also in the pantry, this is one of my favorite parts, you got a huge pantry with adjustable shelves and pull out drawers. Much, much uh, more storage than most. Also, as you come to the back of the unit, you have a loft and it has a built-in ladder. So you don't have to pull out a ladder to get up there. And also as we get to the back of the unit, the garage of the unit, uh, we'll go by this door here, which is the access from the inside to the half bath. Okay, folks, now we're in the garage. The garage is 12 feet deep and will accommodate two full-dressed Harleys or whatever you ride. It's also good for just load up the kids' toys, their bikes and things like that. You'll notice there's a 32-inch color TV with dual sound bars. Uh, you have your AM FM CD player here for music back here. Also, this is the door leading into the half bath, which is also accessible from the kitchen. When you bring your toys in, you want to tie them down so you've got tie downs or D-rings in the floor. They're mounted to steel and rated for 2,500 pounds each, which is very good. You'll never have to worry about things becoming dislodged. Uh, also, you have a beautiful dual sofa set up here with a card table uh, to use in between. And uh, that also makes into a queen size bed. The way this works, uh, you just flip the backs over, which is really very convenient, very easy to do and you have sleeping for two people. You also have an electric bed on top that will come down and there's a stop right about here for sleeping for two more. That's a queen size bed also. I do want to also point out that this can be used any time of the year. You have heat ducts back here as well as air conditioning ducts in the, in the uh, ceiling. Okay folks, now we're on the patio of the Momentum which also doubles as the ramp to get your toys into the cargo area. And when you're using the cargo area, you have a nice screen that comes all the way down to the floor to protect you from bugs. Uh, also, if you'll notice around the perimeter of the patio, you have a nice solid rail. And last but not least, you got a beautiful awning to cover you up when you're out here. I hope you folks enjoyed my walk around of the new 2015 Momentum 385TH fifth wheel toy hauler from Grand Design. And when you get a chance, come visit us at General RV Center at one of our 11 stores throughout the country. Or give us a call at 888-436-7578 or Look, at, look us up on our website at generalrv.com or see me, Gordy Lambert, at General RV Center in Wixom, Michigan and give me a call at 248-866-4599. And remember, every day is a great day for camping.